My name is Julie Rabluski, and I'm the Archivist for Archives and Manuscripts here at the Chicago History Museum, and I'm really excited at the fact that we're able to really give the Sydney R. Yates papers the attention that they deserve. Uh, Congressman Yates was a longtime uh, congressman for the 9th District of Illinois and a well-known champion of everything from arts to senior citizens, fighting juvenile delinquency and violence in the community, um, promoting the welfare of Native Americans, and just countless other causes, and uh, uh, by all accounts, a really uh, well-loved and well-respected public figure. My name is Adam Melville. I'm a recent graduate of the University of Illinois, Urbana-Champaign, and most recently as a project archivist working on the papers of uh, Congressman Sidney Yates. Uh, processing an archival collection is all about making the materials accessible for, for users. And in uh, you know, archival theory, um, original order is a concept where you want to try and maintain records in the order that they came to you. And with the case of uh, Sidney Yates, his papers, he was working with them every day of his career and he had a very solid filing structure and that made processing the collection quite easy. So my grandfather was Congressman Sidney Yates. He was the congressman from the 9th District of Illinois, a position he held for 50 years. Um, he was, he fought for the causes that I think a lot of us hold really near and dear to our hearts, for the arts. He fought for the national parks. And he did so in bipartisan fashion is sorely missing in today's Washington. And he was a statesman in the way that people once were, that people held themselves to a higher uh, account of, of their standing in public. It's, it's deeply meaningful. Um, you know, first of all, the Chicago Historical Society is such a great institution and one that my grandfather loved, of course. And um, again, you know, we just think it's really important that people see this kind of legacy right now, a legacy of fighting for the things that really matter to Americans and doing so in a way that reached across the aisle. And uh, we hope that you know, the lessons that are gleaned from it are ones that people can really take to heart right now.